right, a very good morning to you and thank you so much for joining us on our show. Of course, you are watching Passover 254 only on Deliverance Television. And today we want to discuss about corruption. Let us talk about what is corruption, uh, some of the effects and also the causes of corruption, especially to the youth. This being a youth show, let us talk about corruption effects vitu gani zinasumbua a youth as far as our uh, corruption is concerned and with me here in studio ni my youth yes. leo ni gentlemen exactly. and mumengara leo kwa nini <laughs> welcome to our program Thanks. maybe uh, before we get started just introduce yourselves unaitwa nani unatoka wapi na unafanya nini mimi naitwa Jeremiah Muse mm-hmm. nimetoka Makandara mm-hmm. na mimi ni mwanabiashara mwanabiashara yes mm-hmm. next yeah. mimi naitwa Gilbert mm-hmm. Natoka Nairobi. Mm-hmm. Mini accountant. Yeah, tunatoka Nairobi. <laughs> Nairobi wapi? Natoka Nairobi within Nairobi. Of course I natoka Nairobi. Makadara area. Makadara. Yeah. So uh, let's get started. Today we're talking about corruption. Maybe mtuambi, what is corruption according to you? Yes. Mm-hmm. I can say that uh, mm-hmm. corruption is misuse of public power, mm-hmm. pu- public power mm-hmm. for personal gain. For personal gain. Yes. Misuse haje. Yaani unakuta mtu mm-hmm ame amepewa certain responsibility mm-hmm. lakini venye anaifanya haifanyi ni kwa ajili ya watu watu wasaindike anafanya ni ili yeye mwenyewe asaindike asaindike eh. oh for personal benefits yes. okay yes. boss daily what is corruption just to add on name uh-huh. ni corruption is basically misuse of the public resources mm-hmm. or a bazoment mm-hmm for public or oh, for personal gain that is for personal gain for personal those resources ni kama gani maybe resources kama funds hivi mm-hmm. unapewa funds mm-hmm. una misuse una misuse vibaya unatumia njia eh, ama unatumia authority yenye uko nayo mm-hmm. una, una unachukua pesa kutoka kwa watu ama mm-hmm. unatumia hiyo authority for personal gain for personal gain yeah. so wasawa maybe types of corruption or other examples of corruption number one so, one example of corruption mm-hmm. ni political corruption mm-hmm. where you find people people in, in politics mm-hmm. they are manipulating our uh, rules so that they may retain power or so that they may remain in power mm-hmm. unakuta kuna sheria zingine wana, wanafanya mm-hmm. ili siwave tu ili siwe sikona sina wave wa kai tu in, in, in power mm-hmm. yes any other kuna governmental corruption mm-hmm. where by what wenye kwa government ana misuse funds. Mhm. Bana maybe mtu anaulizwa budget ya a project plan mm-hmm. anaandika project inakuwa more mm-hmm. than it is required. Mm-hmm. Kuna nyingine kama systematic uh, corruption. Systematic mm-hmm. corruption inapata mm-hmm. some institution mm-hmm. kama colleges ni lazima ukiingia upeane pesa ndo uingie that is systematic Aji. corruption. Aji. As in mm-hmm. we, si unataka kuingia ukue students as mm-hmm. then uh, administration inakwambia ama mtu mwenye ako kwa power mm-hmm. anapaza ku, ku enroll mm-hmm. anakwambia umpe some amount mm-hmm. ndio aku aku favor mm-hmm. kwa, kwa nini kwa hiyo colleges mtu akwangi na the degree his own degree the, the, like his some, own papers ama her own papers we have some colleges that mm-hmm. zinakwanga corrupt we have hata kama uko na papers eh yeah, hata kama uko na papers mm-hmm unaambiwa juu au ja qualify uh-huh. au ja qualify uh-huh. then wanasema you have to kutoka kitu kadogo oh for those who are not qualified uh-huh. sivyo sema hivyo uh-huh. kuna shangaa if if at all i have my own papers mbona niende ku, ku bribe ndio niingie shule if you are not qualified if you are not qualified yeah. <laughs> maybe uh tukisonga mbele maybe uh, you tell us uh money is being stolen or rather wasted in our government si tunajua hivyo mm-hmm. maybe you tell us how ama why maybe the ways in which money is being stolen and how is being stolen uh, one way the money is being stolen mm-hmm. is a uh, lack of proper accountability mm-hmm. how you find when mtu ambaye anafasa ku account ikiwa amepewa project flani account amount zenye amepewa mm-hmm. unakuta ile project fit zile ambazo amenunua mm-hmm. they are not worthy the amount amenunua kama juzu lisikia it will bali menunuliwa almost uh, Hundred thousand. Uh-huh. Ukasikia carton in hospitals menunuliwa almost 200,000 uh-huh. of which hakuna carton inaweza toka unaweza toka hiyo amount. Uh-huh. So nakuta hakuna proper accountability of of the resources. Uh-huh. And uh, ni, ni moja ambao azimefanya 
corruption is due sana. Wow. So Gili you talked about kitu about transparency. Transparency. Umesema kuna transparency katika government yetu, si ndio? Mostly. Mostly. Yeah. Maybe you tell us uh, some of the ways in which you can make our government more transparent. Okay, number 1. Mhm. Mm Ju kukuwe na transparency uh, mm -hmm. especially how the money is being used. Mhm. Mm Mojao ni kukuwe na system fulani. Mm -hmm. Kunao majama huwa wanafuatilia. Mm -hmm. Wanafuatilia wajue. Mm Hii -hmm. pesa imetumika hivi. Imetumika hivi. We need to put a system mm -hmm. whereby uh, they will be following up. Mm -hmm. As the project is being reached, mm -hmm. wanafuatilia. And then they come up with proper records. Mm -hmm. Hii kibaiwa inaandikwa. Mm -hmm. Na ilinunuwa hivi na receipts zake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Diyo kukuwe na hiyo transparency. Then, mm -hmm. We have the, the concerned when you wanna kuanga concerned kufuatilia mm -hmm. in the government. Mm -hmm. Wa wafuatilie ju mtu akipatikana ako corrupt anaondolewa. So some systems in, in the in the law mm -hmm. zikuwe enforced in the law mm -hmm. so that they can be followed up mm -hmm. yokuwe transparent. Transparent. Mm -hmm. Maybe any other boss? Yes. Some of the ways in which you can do in order. Need, we need to have to, we need to have proper accounting. Proper accounting. Uh, proper mm -hmm. accounting in ikiwa ni mbrand flani likuwe nafanywa, mm -hmm. kuna, mwenye, kuna mtu ambayo naweza ka account proper ya kwamba mm -hmm. hii mbrand ime cost this amount of money mm -hmm. na ju hii mbrand cost hii amount of money mm -hmm. kulinua hii machine kwa hii kazi alafu nyo likuwa nafanya hii kazi mm -hmm. walilipwa walilipwa kiasi flani ya, ya pesa alafu kuna, kuna, kuna documents kwenye sikuwa ni receipt kuna, kuna receipt na onesha ukweli hii mm -hmm. machine it's mm -hmm. worth this amount of money na ukweli hawa watu ni ukweli ya kwamba walilipwa hii amount of money mm -hmm. yes we need to have that, that proper accounting of money proper accounting yes. any other maybe the ways in which Mm -hmm. ni kwamba mm -hmm. we need people who, who are trusted watu mm -hmm. ambao mm -hmm. because most of people whom we have in in in, in our country mm -hmm. and those, most of people working in those big departments mm -hmm. they are not you, you can't trust them they are not trusted mm -hmm. so that's the big problem we have mm -hmm. kuta wale watu they are they, they, they are not trusted and do you think yes. we have trusted people in our country yes they are there they are there wako tena wengi sana na mbona wapatikani why bona like we are not seeing them. Uh, problem is, while mm -hmm. uh, wale wale uh, the problem ni, ni corruption. Juu kwa sababu nakuta, juu wingi hapo, lazima upiane pesa flani juu wingi kwa hiyo position. Mm -hmm. No, nakuta hile pesa auna. Mm -hmm. So, nakuta mtu mingina ana, anapewa, mm -hmm. ili anapewa so, na pesa, ili yaingia. So, those people who are not trusted, pika hundi hawana pesa, ya kuingia ugandani. Uh, not necessarily that you hawana, not necessarily that you hawana pesa, <laughs> lakini unakuta, lakini kile kiko unakuta, una Ule sila plosinja zambazo inatumiwa njiwa fiki hapo, mm -hmm. you have to give money. You have to give money. Yes. Na pia you have to have connections, eh? eh Lazimu kuna connections. Uh -huh. Kujua na hawa kuba. Uvichi yopia ni corruption? Of course. Kwa tena kuba sana. Uh -huh. So na kuta tu, wale ambao kwa, kwa, kwa hizo posi ni kuba, ni wale ambao tu wame, wame zaliwa kwa hizo posi. Unakuta mtoto wame, akizaliwa likuta mbaba yake ni al, 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 alikuwa, alikuwa MP. Uh -huh. So ila, ila mtoto kupata kasi kuba ni raisi. Uh -huh. Kwa sabi mbaba yake yuko hapo. Uh -huh. Yes. Sasa mimi mbaba angu wakua MP. Just a farmer. Sasa wewe utakuwa mtu mkulima. Ni sahau. Tutaanza mimi kusaidia. Akusaidia ama. Bibi tukimalizia. Eh, kusaidia na. Ama wewe. Eh, mko corrupt. Mekupisa off. No, no. Hautakuwa uh, uh, not only mtu akuwa corrupt, uh -huh. but uh, pia tu Mungu bado tu yuko. Uh -huh. uh, then watu Mungu Mungu akisema tu utaingia hapa tu utaingia. Uh -huh. Yes. Yeah, umeongelea about Mungu. Sa, uh -huh. move on. Maybe uh -huh. the biblical view of corruption. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, Kiangalia Biblia, mm -hmm. Biblia kwanza ime, ime tanja corruption kama jambaa sana. Mm -hmm. Biblia imeongea negativity about corruption. Naweza uka, uka soma katika osea 9-9. Mm -hmm. Biblia nasema ya kwamba, mm -hmm. watu wamekua enslaved, wamekua slaves kwa sababu ya corruption. Na Biblia nasema ya kwamba mungu mwenyewe atawapanish ato mm -hmm. because amewapea ame uhuru na wanja kumbali ule uhuru wameanza corruption. So God himself will punish them. So if you are being involved in corruption, unjua unjua mbado kuna 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 effect yake. Consequences yake zipo. Punishment from God. Yeah, from God. Any other biblical view maybe in your boss amesau? Tell us. Alani ameongea biblical view, but ukisoma Proverbs, I think Proverbs on twenty-five, apo seventeen apo, inakuelezea vinyamungu wa ana ana eight. 
the corrupt people. Mm -hmm. And then he says, is the household of the corrupt mm -hmm. shall definitely come to die. Mm -hmm. So, ukiwa corrupt ni kama una, unachukua kasi, mm -hmm. unajuekea kasi, mm -hmm. then iyo kasi na affecti mpaka household yako. Mm -hmm. so, na kwa Bible, kuna watu nyo uko corrupt? Maybe you let us know. Do we have bilia. examples of people who are corrupt in the Bible? Yes, wapo kwa mbibilia. Kama they nani? Are, they are there. Mm -hmm. uh, Zakias. Zakias, I was a tax collector and uh -huh. he was not collecting what is required. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Even Likwa na oh, collect you know, more. The short, the short uh, guy. Alikuwa na collect more. What do you? The other two, na two what? What tax collectors that are? We are not corrupt. I think in the Kenyan zamani sana. Maybe you tell us some of the conditions favorable for corruption. Conditions. Favorable for corruption. Number one. One is mm -hmm. um, lack of strictness in uh, in punishing those people who are, who are found in corruption. Mm -hmm. Unakuta, akuna strictness ya ya, ya kupanisha wa watu. Mm -hmm. Unakuta enye mtu ni huya amepatikana, ame, ame, mm -hmm. ame, ame corrupt, ameimba ame pesa, pesa. Unakuta, akuna, at, at, kiwa nafuatiliwa, nafuatiliwa tu, akuna uh, strictness ya kifuatiliwa, mm -hmm. nafuatiliwa tu kwa, kwa Kwa mda mfupi sana, mm -hmm. alafu inaishia hapa. Inaishia hivyo. Mm -hmm. Maybe yes. any other condition? Mm, lack of uh, accountability. Mm -hmm. Lack of accountability is one of the favorable conditions. Mm -hmm. Kuna ingine, mm -hmm. as in, unapata the, the money which is being used mm -hmm. is not accountable. Na wenye wanafuatilia, awafuatili wakiwa strict. Mm -hmm. So, that money, hiyo ni condition moja ineza favor. Mm -hmm. Corruption ingine ni zile enforce laws mm -hmm. zenye zimewekwa na wenye wanafuatilianga mm -hmm. wakiwa wanafuatilia hizo law, laws mm -hmm. uh, wako strict sana they are not strict mm -hmm. so hiyo ina favor wenye wako corrupt waendele mm -hmm. hata mtu akiiba mm -hmm. Hakuna law ina mfunga. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Thank you so much of course hatujamaliza we are still coming back. Yes. 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 Hiyo tumekuwa tu part. Mm -hmm. No not by the way. <laughs> Of course, I'm going to show you how to do it. By the way, I'm going to part. Of course, I'm going to show you what is corruption. I'm going to show you some uh, types of corruption or other examples of corruption. And I'm going to show you some of the conditions that are favorable for corruption. So I'm going to take a short commercial break. Then we come back. Of course, I've been talking about uh, corruption. To get to what I'm going to the last part. Or rather, yeah, the last part of it uh, concerning uh, corruption. Of course, the last part, what are some of the causes of corruption? Don't go away.